Good evening, everyone. First of all, I would like to thank the Global Dialogue Forum and its chairman, Mr. Moses, for inviting me. Absolute pleasure to share the dice with the esteemed panelists and the chair, Lieutenant General Sani, Dr. Amita, Mr. Philon, and Dr. Ashok Hosla. So I represent uh, the publishing industry at Indi India. I'm the elected joint secretary at the Federation of Indian Publishers, and I'm here to put my thought from the perspective of the Indian and the global publishing industry, how AI-driven education is, and the sustainable development goals, and role of the publishers, uh, which will be, I, in my personal capacity, it is of immense importance in achieving this. For a long time, priority has been given to spread education. This was necessary. But today, more than expanding education, what is necessary is to improve the quality of education. We will have to shift our priority from literacy campaign to good education. And from now onward, within the schooling, we will have to lay stress on learning. Standing here and representing the publishing sector of a dynamic economy, I believe and I have observed that our industry plays a very critical role in the education sector and the sustainable development goals. The issue of sustainability in education and publishing has never been so important. Sustainability is often now understood in the context of the environment, but also must be understood in the sense of being able to sustain itself and continue long into the future. Publishers have been embracing digital technology and for many years, and I, as a yet new way to help authors reach readers. This digital evolution in general publishing includes ebooks, audiobooks, journals are transitioning to open access formats. Educational publishing is adding more interactive and digital resources. For those of us in publishing, we know that this is an industry that is constantly changing and innovating. A vital part of these innovations is working out which ones will be sustainable economically and enable to publishers to keep investing in further innovations. Today's learning is the focus of every industry and society. And here the artificial intelligence plays a vital role by giving a 360 degree model, enabling students to learn being boundless of time, place, and tangible situation. With AI and tech, humans can be present everywhere today in real time and participate in every activity with the support of developing and growing technologies. The SDGs are a set of these 17 ambitious goals that provide a framework to help, achieve, to help the world to achieve a more sustainable and equitable future by 2030. These goals are the result of a process of consultations of involving all parts of the societies and lay an important plan for the 193 UN member states to, extend, to end the extreme poverty and find inequality and injustice. To achieve these goals, it will take an unprecedented effort by all parts of a society and the publishing industry has a crucial role to play. One goal which truly acts as a base for achieving the rest is the fourth goal, quality education. What do we all understand by quality education? Inclusive, value-based, and authentic fact-based, accessible, holistic, student-teacher relationship where the student attains maximum benefit and develops a fully functional, healthy human being fit to operate within our economies and societies. So ladies and gentlemen, we, here we are clear that the base of any collective society like ours is education. And to achieve sustainability globally, we must focus on quality education. But who can provide us the right resources to attain education or quality education? Before the digital revolution stepped in or was even introduced to the world, individuals had a habit of consuming educational content through hard copies of books, journals, magazines, and more. Here, the publishing industry has been governed in, ever since. With 16,000 publishers in India, we have become the second largest English publishing country and the sixth largest print industry. Publishing industry has been a self-reliant industry, fully sourcing quality of books to schools, libraries, and institutes across the nation and around the world. But in order to achieve all these sustainable development goals, we as an industry wish to touch even the remote or niche areas of our society. We do not want to support in situations, we do want to support in situations like COVID or in any other man-made or natural disaster hits our planet and interrupts our regular activities. Publishers are uniquely positioned to drive progress in the areas of highlighted by the SDGs. We are able to both focus on our own business practices ensuring we operate in a sustainable and equitable way. However, we are the drivers of change, 
able to drive progress across our local industries, especially focused in the areas of education, equality, and justice, giving a voice and platform to those who can shape society and culture for the better. Let me highlight the publisher activities and the progress that relate to the, each of the 17 SDG goals. In some cases, these activities are core to what publishers do best, for example, ensuring quality education. For other goals, such as clean water, the activities may be more indirect and are instrumental in expanding our perception of the broad range of ways in which publishers contribute to the SDG agenda. So the number one is content is king. What we publish remains the core to the progress of SDG agenda. Publishers are uniquely positioned to drive the change through the content and products that are published and created for various sectors and customers. The industry has collectively provided vital platforms to discuss themes represented by SDGs such as poverty, health equality, and the environment. Each goal provides an opportunity to showcase relevant books, be it a book on microplastics in water or a children's fiction book. One well, that describes the importance of water in our lives. Both are vital in helping society understand the issues surrounding water and link this back to the SDGs. Increasingly, publishers are using the SDG framework to categorize their catalogs, providing an easy way for booksellers and distributors to frame content in ways which will promote the SDG agenda. Arguably, the ability to achieve the SDG goals largely depends upon the next generation to be aware of the issues in society and to find innovative solutions for their local communities. This was the one of the founding reasons for the SDGs Children Book Club, brought to life through a collaboration between the International Publishers Association and the United, to, uh, United Nations, together with the support of Bologna Book Fair. The club has curated a list of children books that relate to each of the 17 SDGs in six official UN languages. The other aspect is the equal opportunities for all, the power of diversity and inclusion. The theme of diversity and inclusion runs through multiple SDG goals and is perhaps the best encapsulated by the SDG 5, gender equality, and SDG 10, reducing inequalities. Equal opportunity is also something to consider for our audience and customers. The content that is published is increasingly being used in different ways on different platforms. And there is a clear case to ensure that publishing industry is mindful of making books accessible to those with individual uh, impairments. The IP have led an initiative to gather support for the accessible publishing by providing accessible, sh accessible books consortium charter with over 100 signatories from small to large publishing houses across the world. Building smarter generations. Education remains a key focus. Being able to read and acquire knowledge is fundamental to fighting poverty and hunger. It contributes to education and development, secures work and economic growth, and simply builds a smarter generation for the future. The educational goal, therefore, stands are possibly the most important goal, laying the foundation for success for many other aspects of the SDGs. It is also the core of what publishers contribute and do on a daily basis. An example is an, a publisher, publisher based out of UK, Pearson, an education publisher who have established the Pearson Affordable Learning Fund launched in July 2012 to invest in companies that build solutions for affordable and high quality education services across Africa, Asia, and Latin America. There have been many other initiatives which have been led in the UK and the European region. So these are the handful of projects that are undertaken to improve literacy and in pursuit of the improving education. These serves as a reminder that local industries need to continue to invest and develop these projects in order to equip the next generation with the skills and open minds needed to achieve the goals. It is evident that the education sector is the largest publishing sector in the world. Most developed countries have focused heavily on strengthening their publishing domain so as to produce quality content. Let's work together. Partnership and collaboration remain important. The importance of partnering and working together is such a critical element to achieving the SDG goals that the final goal, SDG 17, is completely dedicated to this theme. The publishing industries is a people's business relationship. Collaborations and partnerships are at the heart of what publishers do each day. However, the publishing industry often faces tough times operating in local markets and is sensitive to economic and political circumstances. Improved sharing of best practices and reporting of data will help the industry to drive innovations that helps achieve global goals encapsulated by the SDGs. The 2030 Agenda for SDG clearly identifies young people as critical agents of change. 
Much of the success in achieving the 17 SDG goals relies on changing established parts of how our society thinks and functions and how much of this task will be left to the next generation. Reading and learning are essential part in a child's growth and development. Books provide a gateway to inspire, foster new understandings, and experience different perspectives. Obtaining a quality education is the foundation to creating a sustainable development. In addition to improving quality of life, access to inclusion education can help equip locals with the tools to require to develop innovative solutions to the world's greatest problems. According to the UN, over 265 million children are currently out of school. 22% of them are of primary school age. Basic literacy skills have improved tremendously, yet bolder efforts are needed to make even greater strides for achieving universal education goals. The world has achieved equality in primary education between girls and boys, but few countries have achieved that target at all levels of education. As publishers, education is simply the part of the collective contribution to the society across all sectors of the industry. Education is core to educational publishers who aim to provide trusted learning resources that teachers need the best implemented local curriculum. We believe the artificial intelligence can be a pipeline where we continue to fuel education in society irrespective of any situation. AI can be a value addition but surely cannot replace the physical aspects of learning, schooling, universities and teacher-student interaction, social interactions within the academic premises, and during the educational activities which stimulate profound learning. AI, a vertical of technology which is not alien anymore. In fact, it is now available in the hands of every individual and is also fully functional at the domestic and professional infrastructures. AI was successful in enabling students to learn and gain quality education even during the time of pandemic. It was successful in providing inclusive, equal, accessible, and value-based education to billions of children across the globe. Machine learning and artificial learn intelligence are the key drivers of the growth and innovation across all industries, and the education sector is no different. According to reports, there has been an upward of 47% of learning management tools which will be enabled with the AI capabilities in next three years. While AI-powered solutions have been in the edtech space for some time, the industry has, has been slow to adopt them. However, the pandemic drastically shifted the landscape, forcing the, forcing the educators to rely on technology for virtual learning. Now, 86% of the educators say technology should be a core part of education. Artificial intelligence has the power to optimize both learning and teaching, helping the education sector evolve to better benefit students and teachers alike. When we break it down, a student's goal is simple, obtain a degree or a diploma, pro proving their knowledge. AI can help students achieve the goal by streamlining the education process, by providing access to right courses, improving communication with teachers, and freeing up to more time to focus on the other aspects of life. AI has a significant impact on the student's educational journey, and, same, and there are the same number of benefits which are meant for the educators as well, uh, which helps Pranav, in the process. Just one person. second, can I just say, uh, can I, Mr. Moses, can we request the staff at the back to stop talking, I think that, creating a little bit of a disturbance. And can we also request somebody to just put on the fans here? I think everybody is uh, profusely sweating here. Uh, so we don't want uh, the SDGs to get failed because there's a power outage already. <laughs> Over to you, thanks, Thank sorry. You for so AI benefits for the educator. Most teachers and faculty aren't afraid to admit that they struggle with their time management, which is understandable given the number of tasks on their day-to-day -day list. Educators want to spend more time on educating students one-on-one -on -one diving into research and continuing their own education, but don't have the ability to do so. AI can help free up educators' time by automating tasks and analyzing student performance and closing the educational gap. From online textbooks to fully remote lectures, the advancements in edtech are tenfold. Today, AI, play, AI plays a role in helping students and teachers optimize and automate both learning and teaching tasks. As the AI industry expands and innovation is at the forefront, we will see the improved learning outcomes for all students and educators. AI can in fact be the accelerator of providing quality education while providing maximum inclusivity, accessibility, and value-based learning to students. The real opportunity for artificial intelligence is how we actually help the 8 billion people that could benefit from these technologies in a practical way. AI offers an extraordinary possibility of accelerating solutions in the time we have to solve the problems. 
hence a hybrid model with more appropriate solution, a model which uses conventional learning styles and modern AI technologies to educate our children and develop them 200% to achieve and maintain a sustainable planet situation. As Nelson Mandela said, education is the most powerful weapon we can use to change the world. With sustainability education, we should try and build a generation of youth with capacity, skills, and knowledge who are ready to take on the challenge. And the list should not only include, and the list should not include only the scientists and engineers, but also people across the board. Thank you so much.